What's going on, y'all? In this video, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go over a lithium-ion battery, and this is from the company JSD Solar, and I did open it up and check it out and made sure it worked because I just have my Newport uh, trolling motor with my Newport mount mounted up on my kayak here, and what I bought this battery for is I got it for running a trolling motor, but there's several things that this thing can go for. You know, a lot of people use it for TVs. You could run an off-the-grid type, like, setup. You can can see right here JSD solar it's the 12 volt I've got the 100 amp hour and this this motor will actually suggest to use a 50 amp hour will give you you know about an hour and a half of usage so this gives me three hours of continuous full throttle on this baby because these do come in uh, 50 50 amp hour they actually come in 200 it comes in a wide variety here and this instructions here it kind of goes over some of the specs this thing has a life cycle of over 6,000 charges that that's a lifetime that's a long time and you know it's got longer life more safety it's a lithium ion it's abs container uh battery fast charging performance so it can go 55 degree temperature range maintenance free bps inside bms which is the battery management system gives you the over the overcharge protection over volt protection low voltage protection short circuit protection basically you're protected with this thing and let's just go over some of the specs right here normal voltage is 12.8 eight uh volts i'm guessing what that is let's go ahead and pull it out and look at it here look at this thing doesn't this just look awesome i love the looks of this thing it comes in its packages i haven't even taken it out i did test it and make sure it works though and the normal capacity is 100 i have the 100 amp hour this is the lithium ion phosphate so it has a, the phosphate's a little better like multiple charging on that product dimensions 260 by 167 by 210 max charging current is 100 uh, charge mode can be basically you could use a solar panel a battery charger you could use a wide variety of things to charge one of these so that's always a plus that you can do that you can run them in series right here you can run them parallel or run them in series and run you a whole off the grid type house on this thing they rate it for ip60 and which is kind of cool that they have that let's go ahead and peel off all of this stuff and here they're saying that the thing weighs 23.9 and a comparable battery of this size would cut would weigh 64 pounds which is a lot when you're talking about putting in a kayak i'm kind of worried about that weight and there's kind of like a little breakdown running a 40 watt uh, you can be looking at 30 hours continuous like a TV. Usually TVs run 100 watt. You can get up to over 12 hours. So like a 12 hours continuous running it. And on this uh, little motor here, this motor, can I can run this thing for three to four hours of continuous use. So let's go ahead and install this. And let me put it on the, the motor there and show you how much energy this pushes on this motor. And what's cool is they already have this set up for me. They have the terminal set up. So I don't need anything but just unscrewing these little caps which looks like they're just pressure fitted down in there so this motor's the newport vessel and i've got the 30 pound thrust on this one and this motor is awesome and i have it in this crescent cooler and you see how this cooler runs as a battery box what i'm going to do i'm going to go ahead and screw all this in i have a relay right here and then this thing fits perfect right down in there so let's go ahead and set this thing up. okay so we got our we're going to run just negative screw these in and these do have locking washers on them okay so you see I, all i had to do was tighten down the positive and negative and i ran this cord out and check this out this seals it down in there it sits down like this the wires running out here and i want y'all to check this out so there's a battery indicator lights right here i am fully charged and here we go so we go one two three four look at that full power that battery works great i don't know if you guys can see how well that thing works and then we can go all the way to reverse that works awesome i can't wait to get this thing out on the water that's all i got today on the you know the js solar let's put it right here 12 volt 100 amp hour lithium ion phosphate battery get you a trolling motor let's go to town see y'all in the next video